using all physicians formula and yeah so physicians formula is a drugstore brand you can find it at Ulta, Walgreens, CVS, anywhere basically Sephora. but let's get started so this is the foundation I'm using at Earth's BB cream and I'm not sure if this will match because it is new so let's put this on and it's like hollow And there's a little tabby thingy, so I have to peel it off. Oh, we found this stuff. Oh, they also sell that at Walmart, I think. And, okay, I found this at Walmart, and it's a flower beauty sponge. And this is, like, better than the beauty blender. I'm not even joking. Like, and it's cheap. And it's cheaper, so. Go to Walmart and get your flower beauty sponge. So, yeah. Oh, and Milo loved his pup box. He's like obsessed. And it's kind of a thick consistency, or I already can tell. And it's a pretty good color. It smells like foundation. It matched pretty well. And it's really light coverage. Okay. So next I'm gonna go in with the concealer. And then this is new, so I don't know if it's gonna match. It's a full coverage concealer and it comes with a little sponge. It has a pump. <laughs> so that took forever. So like a light coverage concealer, but like I said before, the packaging is it. Next is the press colored press powder. I mean, multi colored press powder. So it comes with a sponge, and then this is what it looks like. And look, it's got a mirror so I can see my beautiful face. This is what color it is. Whoa! This blends really evenly. Okay, so I really like the powder. Next, I'm gonna go in with the eyeshadows and it's called Shimmering Strip. Sparkly, bro. I really like the turquoise. Tur turquoise. So I really, like, I really like the turquoise. And then they don't have a blending color in this one. I'm gonna go into Sonia Kashuk. So that other one didn't work. So I'm gonna go into Sonia Kashuk. Go for this my crease. So we got that crease color, now I'm going to go in with some tape. And then I'm going to go in with this bronze color. And I'm going to put that on the outer edges and the inner corner. And I'm going to leave the middle.
finished with that, so now I'm going to go in with this darker shade and I'm going to darken the outer V. So I'm going to use the brush they are sponging they apply. We provide. So now we darken the outer V, so now we're going to go in with the gold shade and I'm going to put that in the center. That's the gold. Oh, there is, I took the tape off, there's my sharp line. And now I'm going to go in with turquoise. And then I'm going to go underneath. So I finished with the eyes, now I'm going to go in with the bronzer. And I'm going to mix these two together to get the perfect shade. And here's the packaging, it's super pretty. Their brushes that come with their stuff are pretty decent compared to other people's brushes. It's an angle. So this brush is more for like contouring more than bronzing, so I'm going to use a different brush. Not a bad bronzer. Next we're going to go in the blush, and is this blush like pretty or what? It's like gorgeous. Rose. So I'm going to use this brush. And I love how there's the gold. But that's weird, after one swipe, the gold is gone. So. There's like some gold sparkles. And it smells like perfume. Next is the highlighter and this is a powder, it's a powder palette in glow pearls. And I always love their highlighters because they're so creative with like the pearl design and everything. Like look at that, there's a pearl on top. And it, it comes with a brush, but I'm not going to use it. And this is what it looks like. Okay, you guys, this is like a bad highlighter kind of. There's unless you like a subtle sparkle. So if you're looking for a really good highlighter that's shiny, I wouldn't recommend this one. It's very dull and like subtle, but I don't really like this one, so I wouldn't recommend this one. So I'm gonna try a different highlighter out, and I'm using the Shop Miss A. I almost forgot what the store is called. How can I forget though? And this is like the Settler Rainbow one. So let me try this one. And this is a dollar on Shop Miss A. It's a dollar and literally the glow is better. So you can see this one's a little bit better and it's cheaper so. Next, I'm gonna go into the lips. I'm using they don't. I couldn't find a Physicians Formula lipstick, so I'm gonna use one like a ColourPop. And, so this is a ColourPop lippy stick, and it's in Fetch. That's so Fetch. I just watched Mean Girls. I watched the second one. The second one is not that good.
Next is the Boxum lip. And these always make my lip tingle because I think they're a pumper. And it's in white Russian. And it's kind of like a lip pumper. So here's the completed look. Let me get my lashes and I'll be right back. So I got my eyelashes on and this is a completed look. So let me zoom out. So here it is and I really like how it turned out but yeah, and the only things I don't like are the eyeshadows. Like they're good pigmentation, but they just don't have a blending color, a matte blending color. Next, I don't like the concealer because of the bottle, and the concealer itself is kind of thick, so I wouldn't get this again. Um, I didn't like the highlighter; wasn't very pigmented, and everything else was okay. But they did, it was like a mix between bad and good, so. And comment down below if you found something in lip products from Fitchers and Formula, because I couldn't. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Click the bell, leave a like, and I'll see you guys next time on Miss Cooler 12. Bye!